Hey everybody, welcome to a Microsoft Flight Simulator SDK tip video. Um, most of you that develop software already know know this, but for, for you people that are just getting into it, or some people that just don't know, okay, this video might be for you, all right? In our video, in our, in our, um, creating our directories for our projects, okay? There's, in the package sources, there's the folder model lib. That's, that's pretty much default, okay? When you build your package, you're gonna get in the, in the uh, My Company Scenery folder, you're gonna get a file called model lib.bgl or bugle, bugle file, okay? That is the generic naming of, of the, the model library um, uh, file, okay? If many flight simulator designers, scenery designers, use the same name, and you're putting all the scenery in your community, fo community folder, this has the potential to cause conflict in scenery, okay? You could overwrite, or not really overwrite, but you can override, in, a, in an essence, somebody else's scenery that they've spent hours and hours and hours working on. And, try, and somebody, uh, somebody's not getting their scenery correct, okay? I mean, not the designer, but the customer, consumer, flight simmer, whatever, is not getting the scenery that they downloaded, okay, loaded properly in their sim. So what we need to do right off the bat is when we create a uh, scenery uh, file structure um, is to make sure that model lib directory has a unique name, okay? So let's come down to my uh, my second version of BKL. Notice that my model lib has something unique in front of it, BKL2 in this case, all right? So the, all my models, my directories that have the buildings and all that kind of stuff for this particular scene is inside this folder. Um, now, the next step is to tell uh, the SDK the new location since it's not the generic default name for the model library okay you've changed that directory name so the SDK needs to know during the build process that that location has changed it's basically changing the the path name to the asset directory okay so let's uh, move this out of the way here I'm, I'm open in the original uh, BKL, and you notice that my uh, model lib, which is the default name for projects that it comes in when you're building your project. But if you come over here to the inspector, notice that when I first built this, it was pointing to model lib. Then when I build this scenery, I get a file in the my company scenery the scenery my company folder called model lib uh, .bgl, okay? Because this says my model lib and this says model lib, okay? So I'm going to close this one up. I'm going to show you how I renamed um, for BKL two to make it more unique. So let's close this project and let's open up BKL2. Okay, notice that the model lib has a unique name. Okay, BKL2 underscore model lib. And if you look, if I click on that and you look over to the right in the inspector, Here's the unique name that I'm giving that uh, bugle file now, that BGL file. And here's where 
the uh, SDK is to look to build that package. All right. I change the path to the folder name that I renamed that model lib. Okay. Once you build this, the bugle file in question is going to be bkl2 underscore model lib. Okay. And that will be less likely to conflict with somebody else uh, model lib. Okay. So when you're creating scenery, um, the first thing to do when you're changing all the XMLs to all the different names of your project, also change the model lib folder name to something unique to your project. But don't forget in the SDK to make that uh, point to the new uh, folder that you've renamed. I hope this makes under. I uh, hope this. Uh, I hope you understand what I'm talking about. Um, if you're having difficulty, leave comments uh, and I'll try to answer them. Um, but we don't want to step on other people's projects. So make sure that your model lib folder in your project has a unique name and that you're pointing to the correct place when it creates the, the build package. So if we look at the uh, build package between the oh, oh, the the default way and the preferred way. If I look in BKL and I go to the packages and I open up the built package, go to scenery, go to my company, you'll notice that originally it created modellib.bgl. Okay? But in the new way or the preferred way, if I go to BKL2, go to packages, open up the package, go to scenery, my company, that bugle file has a more unique name that will not conflict with somebody else unless somebody else creates a project exactly named that I have. Okay, so best practices, change that model lib directory to something unique so you don't step on somebody else's scenery. Okay. So good luck with your scenery design. Uh, we're all in this together to have fun and make uh, Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 more enjoyable and more realistic. And be sure to subscribe, uh, subscribe to my channel and leave comments, like, and share these videos. And we will see you later.